cut. He must have caught part of Billy Jack's uh, arm or shoulder on the back of his head. There's a try for a pin on a big man. He throws him off almost through the assassin on top of referee Sandy Barr. Fifth man in the ring this gone. evening. There's a snap mare, my uh -oh. partner Don likes to call it. Yeah. Oh, okay. Heading comes in, breaks that up. Sandy Barr caught Rip Oliver trying to come in the ring. He said, get out of here. Assassin coming back on top of Billy Jack. There's a right elbow. Billy's got started to get those hands up around his face, start blocking some of those shots. There's a knee by Oliver. He can get his win and get his presence of mind wrapped up here. Well, hey, arm whipped by Oliver. There's a back body drop by, All right. by Oliver. Boy, that was a pressure little kick. I don't know where Billy got him, but he got him good. He came off of that with a right knee. Look, he's still dazed. Yeah, Billy Jack. He's stumbling around over there, Don, trying to make it to his corner. He's going to make got it. it. Here comes Kurt Hennig. One, two, three. There he goes. Hennig's on fire. Yeah, it's the 4th of July right now. Coming out with an elbow. Another. Oh, oh. Oliver moved out of the way, and Hennig caught the mat. Right on the back. There's the tag made by on the assassin. Body slam. Here comes the assassin from the top rope. <laughs> Almost. I love it. We're all even. One fall of peace in our championship match. <laughs> we'll be back with more after this timeout. Don also asked me to mention that don't, don't forget the big Elvis Presley program next Friday, June the 24th here at the Sports Arena. Big Elvis Presley program, June the 24th, next Friday. Two-hour personal movie of Elvis and a one-hour band, uh, whatever that says right there. Oh, I already talked about that. One-hour band music. Yeah, band call. music, yeah. And you call 289-4222 for information. 289-4222. Tickets are on sale for the 24th for Elvis Presley here at the Sports Arena. 8 p.m. next Friday. That's the assassin with that hammer lock on Kurt Hennig. And really, really barren. Look at it, he's got that thing locked in there. This one is it. This is the last fall for the for the belt. The title is on the line. Of course, you know who holds the title, the assassin and Rip Oliver. Oh, right into Rip Oliver. Yes. Teamwork. That's why he calls tag team. Now the assassins very wisely get fresh blood in. His partner, Rip Oliver, immediately drops an elbow on Kurt Henning when he visits the ring. The tag try by Kurt. Missed it. Now that's Ooh. a snap mare, Don. Yes, indeed. That's what you call a snap mare. The other one over the shoulder is a flying man. Okay, well, that definitely uh, had a snap to it. All right. Can we still call them both? Did just you that think day? Mommy got me a new suit? I did. It's my new black suit. That is beautiful. Yeah. I'm just beautiful. Oh, I tell you, you, you look like you stepped out of the center field, center fold of. I stepped out of center field. field. You yeah. came in from left field <laughs> too, Charlie. There's an arm stretch by Rip Oliver. Uh, so much for that one. Okay. Well, you're looking good. As Dandy Don Cross tries to apologize his way out of a hickey. <laughs> a what? <laughs> I'm not going home tonight. Okay. Oops. All right. Henning trying fervently to get back to his corner. To tag the big Billy Jack on the other side of the ring looking at you. Oliver has him in a rather promiscuous position. Here comes the assassin to break the concentration. Kurt tries for the tag. Didn't make it. Rip reaches up and pulls Henning down by the hair. Referee Sandy Bars, his attention was on the assassin. And Oliver saying, no, I, uh, I do something uh, illegal. Come on. Not 
Love this me. program being brought to you by KPTV Channel 12, Portland Wrestling, the finest wrestling television show in the entire United States of America. And surrounding the city. And we've got the world's greatest fans right here. Look at them. This place is packed tonight. It's jumping. And right now they're yelling, we want Kurt. And Oliver's got him. Trying to make the tag with Billy Jack. Not yeah, quite a yes, comes in again, Don. All it takes is that momentary distraction. Yep. It gives your partner time to do what he has to do. In Oliver's case, is get him down any way, shape, or form he could possibly do it without the referee seeing him, and he did it. Gone. Gone. Well, he's really yanking on that left arm of Kurt Henning. Got the uh, wrist I'll back. bet you, but I can barely hear you, Don. If I'm walking on you when you're talking, I can barely hear you in my headset. Okay. Now read, read, read my lips. <laughs> now I say he's really yanking on that left arm. You got the wrist locked back and uh, bent back. Look at that. Look at that move by Hennig. Hennig rolled right over Oliver, and Oliver reversed it back into that hammer lock. And here, Hennig. I don't know if you can hear Henning yell or not. Well, he's in pain down there. Look at this. Here comes him. That doesn't help the situation. Here comes the assassin. The assassin coming down. Knee right in the small of Kurt Henning's back. The noise sometimes in here, ladies and gentlemen, gets deafening. We're sitting right a bunch of, above a bunch of people that are yelling and screaming and hollering. They're, their lungs out and sometimes I cannot hear like right now even myself talk the sound is deafening you have to get down here some Saturday evening come on down